foster mom in Brevard County has now been charged with murder after a young girl in her care died last month. Lakeisha Mitchell faces first degree premeditated murder. And as West Chu's Marley Martinez learned, she was not only a foster mother, but an employee with the school district. Okay, Miss Mitchell, you. Lakeisha Mitchell is behind bars without bond. She's been arrested now on murder in the first degree. The 41-year-old foster mom has been in jail since August 23rd, at first charged with aggravated child neglect and abuse. Which is a first-degree felony. After a four-year-old girl in her care died. Now that charge has been bumped up to first-degree murder. It's the most heinous crime that we have in society. Titusville police say they went to Mitchell's home on Queen Street after she called 911, saying the girl was unresponsive. According to the arrest report, Mitchell says the girl was throwing a temper tantrum and faking that she was unconscious. So to calm her, Mitchell told police she put the girl in the bathtub. Mitchell says she left the bathroom and when she came back, the girl was unresponsive. She died at the hospital two days later. But the medical examiner later found no evidence of drowning. An autopsy instead found the girl died of blunt force trauma to the head and strangulation. Our focus in this investigation is to ensure that justice is found for the young child and her family. According to Brevard Public Schools, Mitchell was an employee for the past five years, first as a custodian and then most recently as a clerk at Coquina Elementary. A district spokesperson says she was fired after her arrest. Meanwhile, investigators aren't saying exactly how many other foster children may have been inside of the home, saying that's part of the ongoing investigation. She had been a foster mom for a few years, so there's likelihood there was other children in that house throughout the last couple years. In Titusville, Marley Martinez, West Tune.